Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Welcome to my another video on Android app development and so guys this will be the part 2 of my video series on Firebase using Android Studio Alright guys so without wasting any time let's get started so let's first of all create a project in Android Studio okay so here I will say that uh, let's say the project name is Firebase 2018 alright and let's change it to our default folder so let's create the project okay in our phone and tablet let's change it to let's say four five all right so click next and click finish all right guys so I will teach you slowly slowly but hopefully I will make you the expert of Firebase okay I will try to teach you in a very simple way and if in and if in any uh, part of the video if you have any question you can always comment down and I will uh, answer all of you all right so you just have to follow me okay so in my Android studio I always get this error whenever I create a new project I don't know why if anyone has uh, this solution they can comment down okay so uh, in order to do in order to remove the error what I do is I go down to build dot gradle and here I change this uh, app compat uh, dependency and I then I go to file project structure and I click on app then dependencies click on library dependency alright and then we click on ok and here you go in this way the error uh, is gone so now first of all uh, uh, in firebase what you need to do is first of all you need to go to the firebase uh, console and in there you need to create your project and after that you need to create your app and integrate your app by providing your package name okay your application package name so how i am going to do that so first of all let me first change that to relative layout all right and after that you need to go to your website and here you need to say firebase all right here uh, this window will be open but you need to select your uh, so in this case i will select this one all right so now click here go to console so you need to go to console and create a project there let's see if i already have a project or not okay so here i have this project so i will click on add project okay and i will name my project as firebase 2018 alright and from there I will select my country Pakistan and I will click on create project okay so the first step is you need to create the project okay in the Firebase console we have to wait uh, a little bit uh, let's finish this okay so now there you can see your new project is ready now you need to click on continue okay so now here you can see welcome to Firebase so here you need this one add uh, firebase to your android app okay so we will click that and here they are asking for our android package name okay so how so now you need to go to your android studio and then go to build.gradle and this is your application id or your package name okay just copy that and again go to firebase and paste it okay and the second thing is uh, SHA1 certificate it is optional so we don't need to enter that but let's 
uh, okay so now we need to click on register app all right so now this you can see uh, download google services json so you need to click on that okay you need to download the google services json and you just need to copy that and then you need to go to project view okay and go down here application source okay in uh, source you need to just paste it here and click ok all right this is the way of uh, adding the json file this is the configuration file basically okay so the next step is you need to go uh, click continue ok so now here you can see that they are saying you to add this line ok so you just need to copy that and go down here and click on build.gradle and inside that class path ok so you need to paste that ok and you don't need to click on things now uh, ok so let's open that again and here you, they are saying that you need to add this line ok compile file base core so just copy that and just close that ok so here you need to paste it so you will just paste it here and ok also they are saying that to add this we copy and paste it right at the end of the file ok so now you can click on sync now ok so now we click on synchronize now but there will be an uh, error ok you will face the error so in order to res uh, in order to remove the error what you need to do over here ok so you need to go to your build.gradle and inside there you need to add maven ok and there you can say url dot google dot com okay so now you need to uh, try again click on try again and let's see if it works or not okay so there there is still an error because I think I have done a mistake here so let me check I always uh, uh, forget this URL I always forget it I don't know why ok let's change the www so let's click on try again and let's see if this uh, error is gone or not ok so you can see now the alright what is the error alright I think this is uh, the file is not pasted in our app store ok you can see it is not pasted successfully so now we need to just copy that and now we can paste it here now we can see this so now we need to click on rebuild project I think th there is th this is the problem so let me check how to add Marvin dependency in Android Studio and I will just uh, copy the URL
I don't know why I have stuck here so there we can see where is the maven dependency ok let me open a project and let me see ok this is the code I forgot to remove that ok so we just need to remove that and now we can click on synchronize now there you go so now you will be able to see that the build.gradle is finished why is there in a alright guys so we I just need it ok so what was the problem the problem was that we needed to add the uh, paste the google services dot json in our app ok this folder so let's go back to our code and now let's we try to rebuild the project and this time if it will run successfully there you go so as you can see the error is gone and we are now able to use firebase in our android application okay so first thing uh, you need to first of all let's set the user permission so we can say first of all internet permission okay firebase only required you to have internet permission in your android application all right guys that's it for now if you like the video please like share and subscribe and in our next video we will start doing the firebase authentication all right so please like share and subscribe goodbye